What's going on guys? Spencer here with HM Massage. What do we do if we have a massage and our male client gets an involuntary body function? A hard on, a full salute, the raging salmon, an erection. It's natural and it does happen. So this is a valid topic. And while women as well also get turned on on the table, they obviously don't show it as easily as guys do. So let's talk about how to handle it. First off, everybody needs to stop freaking out so much. Therapist and clients alike, the more you think about and the more you concern yourself with it, the bigger deal it's gonna become. And this is a big embarrassment for guys. It's a big thing they're concerned about, especially if they've never had a massage before. But the more you think about it, and if it does happen, the more you concern yourself with it, the longer it's gonna stay. As opposed to letting your mind go and not thinking about it, and then naturally it's gonna fade away. Same thing with therapists. If your client does start to pitch a tent on the massage, don't stare at it, don't make a huge deal about it. Even if it is a huge deal, you know what I'm saying? Focus on the massage and distract yourself from it. It's gonna go away, or if it doesn't, it's gonna be there, but you don't have to be focused on it. Remember, 99% of the time, the erection comes from simple parasympathetic nervous system stimulation. Essentially, we're rubbing their skin, we're touching their body, and especially in a relaxed state of mind that comes from massages, the senses are heightened, and so it's natural to sometimes have a body reaction to that stimulation. And while massage is not sexually intimate, massage can be a very intimate experience between therapist and client. So it's natural that sometimes the body is gonna react in this manner. But not over-concerning yourself with it and simply ignoring it it's gonna handle itself on its own, unless the client acts on it. If you are a client getting turned on and you are now acting on that, you're acting unprofessionally, or worse, you take things to a physical level, that's not okay at all. The therapist has every right to end that session right there and kick you out. And therapists, the second they start acting on it, you can give them a warning, but if they keep going, or you feel they're too inappropriate, you end that massage right there, that client's done. But that is the extremely rare case. 99% of clients come to massage for the therapeutic benefits. Most people aren't trying to get the happy ending out of it. And as the client gets more and more massages, their body gets used to that nervous system stimulation, and so it's gonna happen less until it doesn't happen at all. And then the therapist and client can both receive the mutually beneficial aspects of getting a massage and allow massage therapy to stop their pain, improve their health, and enhance their life. Cool! Thanks for watching guys, hopefully you enjoyed this quick little video. Give it a thumbs up if you did, and subscribe to the channel for new content every single week. I will see you guys on the next video. I hope you have a great rest of your day.